Pretty sure. Here, let me. Because ET never goes anything but Amolga, so. And this, whoever we're watching went Mew, so this is definitely Falco. No, ET's on this side. Yep. ET e is on this side. Player so one is the Oh, okay. I didn't know that. All right. I think we need you for a match. Oh, well. I can okay. cover this. All right, cool. All right. So, Falco versus ET. These are the oh, two, uh, two, our two favorite burbs. Um, okay, so. Falco starting off with a nice Soaring Sands X. Oh, here we go. Full combo here from ET. Let's see, can she get all the way to the wall? Nice there. Full combo. Getting the wall splat and arrow set up. Straight into throwing some projectiles. Really having a lot of um, success with those throwing sense wise in field as of late. Alright. Straight for the Amolga. Ooh, does catch. And able to combo off of it. Alright. Oh, Sally drops a combo. Oh, man. Perfectly meaty. Oh, this can be a full combo. Ooh, nice acrobatics there. Okay, that's big damage and a reset. Full arrow. Man, ET is really rocking it right now. I, 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 I'm trying not to be biased, but it's really hard. Oh, almost has it. Just needs to get one last hit. Oh, maybe one more last hit. And what's the option? Oh, nice frenzy plant. Covers a lot of options there. Goes straight for the burst. She really wants to confirm this and gets it. All right, ET getting the first round very, very strongly right there. Oh, I cannot be biased. Ah! <laughs> Falco, just... Uh, I know this earlier in, Fal uh, in Falco's match against Bacala. She's having a hard time getting the defense. And E.T. adopting a more um, aggressive strategy here. Really forcing the oh, offense. Getting a nice counter pierce here. Oh, gets the opening. This could be a big combo. Oh, no. I can pass. Unfortunate. I think that's character specific in that situation. Ooh, full combo here from Falco. Oh, drops it, unfortunately. Nice frenzy. Oh, a lot of damage from that. Oh, okay. Goes for burst. Falco is staying on hers. Holding on to it for just a little bit longer. Oh, goes for the grab. But Sierra Shackle is minus, so Falco does win in that situation. We got a release Y here. All right. ET's still sitting on her burst attack. Oh, goes for it. That's going to hit. That is going to hit for a lot of damage. All right. Sweet. And it's going to lock out that Mew. I will say um, Falco could be getting a little bit more mileage out of that Mew because it's a... 20 second charge every single time. Then you just pop it, pop it, pop it, pop it. Um, it's very non-committal on usage. All right, ET in a really, really good position right now. Um, all right, what's the option? Ooh, this glutes to a full combo. Ooh, a little bit of panicking here. Oh, wow, that did not crit? Crazy. Okay. Oh, actually, it still gets a combo. All right, what's the option? What's the option? Ooh, what's the option? What's the option? Oh, she gets it. She gets it. That's it. All right, E.T. takes game one over Falco right there. Oh, my God. It's hard not to be biased. All right. All right, Falco, I that I don't think she was able to call Mew once there. I think that support really was not helping her. Um, yeah, and we are going to get the switch here. Okay. All right, so sticking to the Sidgewai, but what is the support choice here? Mega Ray. Okay, that's what I'm more used to seeing from her. So Mega Ray, um, I'm not sure if ET is aware of all the counterplay you can do with Mega Ray, um, and what to do to avoid it. So she might be eating a lot of Mega Rays, and that could be a huge chunk of damage onto her. However, that will mean ET will probably get synergy more if she is very liberal with the Mega Ray. So um, ET could probably get the synergy burst more and keep that advantage going if she takes advantage of it. All right. Starting off, E.T. going into the air. All right, nice patience there from Falco. Oh, does not get the counter. Ooh. All right. Nice adaptation from E.T. Oh, but a cross up there. Getting aggressive. Going for the nicely spaced acrobatics. And gets the wall spot. What's the combo? Oh, no. The 8 8 misses. Ooh, that's a big sucker punch. Big, big, big sucker punch. And Falco already seeing a full burst with the Mega Ray in the back. Oh, is this going to face change? Oh, is this going to hit? Uh, this could be... Oh, that's very unfortunate for Falco. She still loses the Mega Ray and the Burst. All right. So now, Falco, um, E.T. is in a position where she can make a comeback happen here, but goes with the grab. That's not a great option right there. All right. Ah, yep, there's a nice grab. Falco's been holding on to that grab for a while. Hasn't been throwing this out very often here. Nice release Y. E.T. really um, being aware of it, shielding a lot of them. Oh, nice. Gets the 
punish there. Are we going to see a burst from ET? She's going to try and make this comeback happen here. Not the best odds. She is in a huge health deficit. This burst is going to hit the shield. Do considerable amount of chip, though. Oh, all right. Just let's it happen. Oh, that's going to be it. Falcon can probably confront, kill off this if she gets a full combo. Oh, unfortunately, drops it. Oh, aggressive frenzy plan. Kind of risked it all right there. That could have been really bad if she missed that, if she uh, whiffed that. All right. Really went all in on that. All right. Uh, ET did. All right. So going into round two here, Falco in a really nice um, resource position. Beer, but oh, that spear shot was. I think it's gonna hit. And gonna waste the mega ray again. Oh no, it whiffs. Okay, that mega ray is gonna be a lot of initial damage here. Um, onto ET. Oh, nice reactions there. All right. I don't know if that actually was a true punish or not. Um, go for the Emolga. I think that'll hit. Goes for the arrow. It does get it. Thing is that um debuff the uh, support debuff isn't gonna really gonna do much anymore because Mega Rayquaza will never recharge after the first use. Anyway, gets a nice combo off. Still a pretty even um health game right now. Oh, goes straight in with the forward Y. All right, a burst out. Et is really close to her own burst. Um, oh, actually the AD is actually colliding in the air. I didn't know they did that. Oh, that was a dangerous move by Et. All right, use a burst, Et. Use a burst. Use a burst. Oh no, no, that's a light. That's a light. Use a burst right now. Use a burst. Use a burst. That's not your burst. That's not your burst. Please use a burst. All right. Please use a burst. Thank you. Okay. Thing is, Falco is... Oh, is that out of range? Is that out of range? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. So, ET needs to make a comeback happen right now. These do about 200 damage worth right now. Still in the realm of possibility. And that has evened up the game right there. All right. So, let's see. We can see a, uh, a release wise charge from Falco. Oh, oh no. Okay, gets the 4Y to kill off of that. We're going to game three here. This is a really, really close cool set. Okay. This is good stuff. And I'm having mild heart attacks this whole time. Um, all right. So I think the Mega Equates of Choice really did help um, Falco in the long run. Definitely getting a lot more use out of it than Mew. There's a fly right here. Oh my god, I'm going to cry. Ah, I'm crying. Alright. Oh, I never even noticed that um, Falco is actually using Whimsical. Um, she did unfortunately get nothing right there. Um, but Whimsical can can come in handy when it chooses to. What? Haven't been watching her Whimsical luck, so. Alright, so. Going into round one here. What is the options? Go straight for the homing. Alright, go for the aggressive counter. Oh, it falls right into the floor wide and actually able to convert a full combo off that since she was in the air. Oh, man. I'm having a hard time delaying those, um, four JYs. Oh, Friends might actually getting beaten out there. Alright. Um, the Mega Ray is in the back, so ET does have to be afraid of that. Alright, going for grabs. Now, this is what I'm talking about when Falco can get aggressive. She really, really can put the hurt on. Um, that Emoga is gonna hurt. Um, here comes Mega Ray, but I think ET should be able to um, shield. Yes, okay, so that's gonna help out a lot. Straight into the four day. Oh, not taking that command grab. All right, and full combo here. Slam down. All right, ET now one HP. Not a great situation. Um, and it looks like Falco's gonna get that burst first, but she is pretty um, conservative when it comes to uh, the uh, her burst usage. So. Probably not gonna see it this round. And there we go. Alright. Falco catching on to some of ET's habits. Alright, and now going into this ET. It's almost out of full burst. Um, does have a remote in the back. And goes straight again. Very, very reminiscent of round one right there. Going aggressive with that. Um, Falco knowing that you can counter in between there. There's a gap. Able to abuse that. Oh, a little bit early on the combo still. Nice Emolga, that will punish. Oh, no, it won't! Oh, oh Frenzy Plant, okay, that works. Oh, actually, gets the, gets the mix-up that time around. All right, Falco's a little bit hesitant. We do have a double burst on from both players. Probably gonna see one from Falco coming here soon. All right, and there is. She does have Mega Rate in the back. Might be waiting um, for her burst to run out to do that. Don't use lights on burst the opponent's ET. Burst right now, burst, thank you! Okay. All right, I'm probably gonna see the Mega Rate here soon and the burst attack. Oh, that was a risky A day. Risky, risky, risky A day. All right. Oh, is that gonna is that gonna confirm? Is that gonna confirm? 
Ooh, I don't think it's gonna kill though. I don't think it's gonna kill. Mega Ray is in the bag. That can make a comeback happen. Um, but this is gonna be a rough situation for Falco. Probably gotta take this to round three if ET can get that last hit in. What is the offer? Probably has a release white in the back. Yep, there it is. That's punchable. Ooh, not with that though. Not with that. Ooh, okay. All right, all right. ET taking this to round three, game three. My, I'm about to die. I am in, my heart is in so much pain. Um, cause I, I, I really like both these players. I really want them to advance in bracket. I just, I'm torn right now. All right. Switching to Mimikyu going into round three here. Um, gonna be interesting, really interesting to see how she utilizes this. All right. Go to some shield string stuff. The ET with a nice, nice combo coming back from it. All right. Gets the reset. Oh, misses the Forex. This is a counter combo coming in here. What's the combo? 21 hits there. All right, both players do have the burst in the back. Falcon going straight in, aggressive as always. Molga coming in. Nice, acknowledged there by ET. What's the option? Oh, just dash up and grab. Okay, just gonna put some damage on the table. Geared to under 200 HP. All right, probably has the waste white. Yep, there it is. Getting really good about using that. Ooh, that option is plus. Um, now we have a. Um, a reverse coming out from Falco. I have to convert the combo. This is anyone's game right now. Both have to be scared of burst. Oh, that's gonna crit! And that is... Oh, jeez! That's probably gonna do it! That's probably gonna do it! Unless Rage Burst Defense really comes in. I think that's gonna be it. The fact that was a crit is gonna add a lot of damage. Is that it? Yes, it is! ET takes it over Falco! Oh, my God! Oh, my God, I'm so happy. Ah! <laughs> Ah. <laughs> that was a really, really close game. That was really good. I'm so, I'm so happy because watching that, I've just, I've just seen ET improve so much. Falco was doing really, really well too. Whenever she got the advantage, she just keep it going. But ET did so, so well. Ah.